Hey guys, Tim Pokemon here, and in today's video, I'm going to be telling you how to take down Shadow Mewtwo this weekend in Pokemon Go. We're going to have some Shadow Raids for Shadow Mewtwo, and it's a pretty exciting time because Shadow Mewtwo is one of the best Pokemon in the game, if you did not know, if not the best Pokemon in the game. So let me tell you exactly how you're going to take this thing down and what are the best Pokemon to use and how hard is it going to be? Because of course, of course, sorry, these Shadow Raids have been very difficult and honestly, I'm I'm a little bit scared for Shadow Mewtwo. So let's talk about it. We got an amazing graphic from Couple of Gaming over on Instagram and let's talk about it. So first things first, it's going to have apparently the same CP ranges. I don't know if that's 100% true. We're going to have to figure that one out. But if that's the case, it's 2387 and 2984 for the Hundos, which if you get a Hundo Shadow Mewtwo, props to you. Now, of course, obviously the ranges are going to be put down a little bit because of course Shadow IVs are capped at 666 for the raids, not 1010. 10 like a normal raid it's at 666 if you did not know and that is the iv spread now what pokemon are you going to want to use for a pokemon like mewtwo you're going to want to use of course some ghost types some dark types and some that you're going to want to use are chandelure hydreigon with brutal swing which is very good uh giratina of course goldango is actually in there darkrai hoopa unbound gengar mega Banette Mega and Houndoom Mega, those are your top three Megas, but Mega Evolve your Gengar. Shadow Mewtwo's actually up there in the top counters. Shadow Weavile with the Dark Typing and as well as Shadow Tyranitar. Now, those are some great Pokemon you're going to want to uh, bring, but apparently it's going to take five to seven trainers without any Purified Gems, and apparently two to four trainers with Purified Gems. Now, of course, this is unconfirmed because these raids obviously haven't gone live yet anywhere in the world, but we believe that it's going to be around this. And by the way, the Giratina was origin form Giratina, if, if I forgot to mention that. But let's just talk about the additional information. Now, while attacking a Shadow Raid boss, when it becomes enraged, its attack and defense increase. So enrage begins at about 65% health. So that first 35% don't worry, it's not going to get enraged. It'll go down, right? But once it gets enraged, its attack goes up 15 points. And same with its defense. So its attack is already at shadow, 1.81 boost already, base attack. So it's going to get... 15 extra points apparently, as well as the defense boost. That is the boost that we're talking about within Rage, which is pretty crazy and why it could get definitely some uh, pretty scary with Mewtwo. So save up those purified gems. Now, luckily from these raids, you're gonna be getting shadow shards back. And if you just take out some Team Go Rocket leaders between raids and stuff like that, you know, or, or Team Go Rocket grunts and stuff like that, you will be able to get your, uh, you know, purified gems back. But make sure bring Purify gems, stack up 10. I already have my 10 ready for this weekend. You're going to want to stack them up because you're going to need them for this weekend. Now, um, we don't know the exact number yet uh, of how many... Uh of the sorry how many of the gems it takes to make it to its non-enraged state and just its normal state you know because it, they said that it'll turn into just normal Mewtwo it, you, it'll still be encounterable as a shadow Mewtwo and can be shiny shadow of course so good luck to all you guys quick keyword shiny shadow but uh yeah of course so these purified gems we don't know exactly how many it's going to take to make it to its non uh, shadow state which would be awesome because that'll make the raid a lot easier because that'll take two to four trainers any day of the week but uh if you do not know that um the the shadow pokemon also is naturally subdued at 15 percent. if you didn't know that so once it hit, hits 15 percent, it's automatically no longer to be enraged even without purified gems but let me know in the comments down below are you playing these events this weekend are you gonna be doing any raids i definitely am i have a plan to drive up about half an hour uh from where i am at and we're gonna be have a, having a big raid group and we're going to be taking down as many of these raids as we can. We're going to get that shadow shining Mewtwo hopefully. Make sure to subscribe so you guys see more videos just like this one. And yeah, we have a bunch of content for this summer. Can't wait. We got a new season coming up. We'll see what comes. And yeah, we got an awesome Team Rocket event. We have some Team Go Rocket challenges if you guys haven't seen from earlier this week. And shadow Mewtwo raid challenge videos coming soon. So make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.